morning everybody oh it is absolutely freezing um so what we had a lot of stuff for charity um so what we did was we packed it in a few boxes got somebody to take it to our we've got like um an adaptive van so we got people uh, family to take it to the van for us and they just collected it well absolutely freezing out there my hands i can't feel them but um i just wanted to i mean it's probably everybody's sick of this now but i um as i've said many times obviously i've gone into mickey nose don't know why i'm an old woman i ain't got a clue but i've had these come now there is another one inside Let's see if i can just put you down there this is to go with my mickey mouse collection so oh okay sorry and is in there shouting so i wondered what the hell that was now let me just oh this is probably gonna make a noise this is off the microphone uh right bear with me a second i don't know if i can do this ah uh, there you go got you back on sorry if the sound is a bit muffled so this is what i've had because over christmas we're gonna have a uh, family here doing a little bit of nibbles and i thought i make some um probably brownie because i absolutely love brownie and i know my girls like it so i'm gonna make some brownie so these are keg pins to match my growing collection um now i did buy them online because these are not in stock anymore at asda but i also have got a little mat now this camera andy said it to me that camera's okay it's straightened up now so i don't know if you can see it too good i've got a little mat to uh, match it all so i kind of like my mickey mouse collection he's sick of it <laughs> but i do go through phases but kind of like it i mean over the years i've always had different color schemes in the kitchen um years ago quite a long time ago Andy. You're looking a bit wonky there. Hopefully that's okay. Years ago, I've had every colour under the sun in my kitchen. I like to have things matching and all that. And I did have red, but not for a long time. But probably I'll keep the kitchen like a plain colour as it is. But have um, these bits of red in. Uh, good thing about having a light coloured kitchen, you can change the colours. So, um, anyway, while uh we're on sorry uh, now i had a voucher from um this is from freeman's but i believe it's another catalog and i had a voucher because you know we if you don't use it they, they give you so much discounts and stuff so i ordered uh something now him indoors he's going to start learning because um i think new bedding you just can't beat it now i've got we've got a super king size bed um i like a plenty a lot of room so um we have to get everything super king and we well it's a good job we buy online because you can't really uh, find places that have uh, super king quilts we're being cold I thought I'll order this. Oh, that's okay. I'm actually missing something. Um, okay. So yeah, I'm missing something, but it just said it's gonna follow. Um, with it being really cold, um, I thought I'm going to get this. Um, now, our dog, um, when I, he used to sleep in his bed, um, I mean he's only two now, but when I was in a hospital last year, 
uh, and I, when I had all that um, multi seizures um, Andy was always with me wouldn't leave me still is like it now actually um, and so our dog he uh, started sleeping on our bed I don't mind there's been many a times where um, I've woke up in the night and the dog all I see is he's on his back with his two legs right by me um, but he loves uh, lying on our bed now um, and uh, he's always got his own little blanket but um, he likes to get under it and the quilt cover I've got at the moment it, it's a fleece but it's only on top so I've seen this and this is a fleece quilt cover and it's fleece all the way around now it's probably going to get it's going to be too big to fetch out because when you get when you get these at the back they never go back in but oh i'm going to get it out wow that, that does look nice actually so here's the cush the pillow cases um i mean it's not bad uh, it's it's not exactly as thick as I'd have expected it, but it it's grey. I do like grey. Our bedroom carpet is grey. Curtains are dark grey. Uh, so we can have different colours in the uh, bedroom, which I have. But I'm just going with a, just a grey. <laughs> it probably start moaning. It is turning into me from whinging. It's actually nicer that is. So yes, so that is my quilt cover, um, which I should probably put on the bed. Our, our quilt cover, it's like a two-man team kind of thing, uh, right pair of blongers. We're both sitting down on chairs and we have to try and do it between us, which it is very difficult. But um, it is nice. So I might have that put on the weekend. Um, it's uh, just under four weeks till Christmas. I have got a quilt cover for Christmas and I've got a little fleece to match. So the dog's got a little blanket. So I'm loving that. So it's going to show indoors. I'm only going to take him the pillowcase. He'll probably start whinging. Now the living room is probably like a dive because the dog has had a madden and he's been running around with all the blanket. Uh, his toys so okay let me just turn it around <laughs> i've got look at these pair now he said he's not a dog person now our dog is more andy than me no he's well cozy there and yeah he's thinking that poor man been out the cold now it actually i too bad in here the blanket all over the place. Now he's he he was he was ill. The dog was he last week or so. Now I, I brought him a ball pit when we was on holiday, and he did like it. He used to jump in and out, and I used to keep his other toys in there. But I had to throw the ball pit away because the dog can't figure out why, can we? And he's looking at me, thinking, "What she waffling on about?" But the dog was sick and we just threw the ball pit didn't we yes so so we've got to get him another it was a, a cheap thing we... well it's just what we brought on holiday so um we need to replace that and i'm going to show andy this now he's probably heard me well he's been watching tv but i'm going to show him now now i've brought a new quilt cover <laughs> so chris face <laughs> and I've, for a change I've bought grey do you want to no that's the pillowcase it's not as thick as I thought because fleece I wasn't too sure but with that what do you think no because the dog's going <laughs> to the dog's going to jump on you it'll keep me warm and, uh... no <laughs> it's a blocker the dog's looking at him thinking, what the hell are you doing? So, yes. Oh, uh, we we haven't, so we've got 
I'm nearly sat on his ca- on his phone then. Jeez, I'd have broke it. So, do you like the the? I've only brought the pillowcase in, but do you like it? It's all right. Yeah, it's a bit thin. Yeah. Because I I kind of I'm I'm not fussy fussy, but um, I have like fitted sheets on the bed because I can't stand. Uh, you know, if you lie on a sh- ordinary sheet, it goes ruffled up underneath you. I hate that. And okay, the dog likes my pillowcase. <laughs> he likes the pillow. Yeah, he approves. That dog likes to be smothered. Um, so I don't even know what I was on a bed. <laughs> oh God. Oh, okay, okay. I've just remembered. God, my memory is so bad. So I was saying um, we have fitted sheets because um, I don't like the sheets ruffled up. Um. So, uh, I tend to buy like cotton sheets because also what I don't like is where years ago when I've had different colour schemes, I'd buy like just cheap sheets and you throw them not long after, they go bobbled and so now I just tend to buy um, Egyptian cotton. But I can't, that fleece cover is not going to last long really, is it? Because it's, it is really thin. I mean, I can't Probably remember. Is. You buy cheap, you buy twice. I don't think it was cheap, though. I'll have to check that. But I did have a voucher, so I'm going to have to check up on that. But the dog's already lying on it, so I ain't going to be able to send that back. Hello? He's loving it. So, anyway, I don't know if you've mentioned it on another video, because sometimes another thing, a habit I've got is I repeat myself. So, did we mention about the London... Or idiot. I, don't know. I can't remember if we've put it on a video now. I just can't remember. Anyway, we are going to London. I do feel like I've said it before. I'm going to say it again anyway. We ain't, we've got quite a few subscribers, but no one will probably yeah, recognise that I've said it before anyway. We are going to London. We're setting off really early in the morning. And we're going to hopefully drive through and see all the Christmas lights at, okay, his cup centre. Luckily, my ain't. <laughs> Where are we driving through London? Whereabouts? Because... Well, where the lights are. Uh, Oxford Street, Regent Street. Yeah, so we're going we're gonna to set off really early in the morning. So we're hoping to... Because there's no chance driving down in the day. You're going to be stuck in traffic and... Well, the it, lights won't... Well, the lights will be on, but at it just night. Might look good, it? But I have looked online. I think the lights have already been switched on. Uh, but but that big building, the shard, that looks amazing. So hopefully we're going to drive around there. But pop in, see the old family. Yep. Yeah, but he has ordered another camera. What camera have you ordered? I forget now. Where it's on loan. Uh, I'm just testing it out. It's not on loan. He's brought it and he's going to have a look at it to see if it's any different to the one we got. It's not on loan. So the it, thing is, the uh, we use a GoPro. Uh, we don't use our phones because our phones are full of. It, the, the memory's filled up. On well, not it, only so. that. I mean, holding the phone still is hard for us and. That this camera seems to be better. So we, we got a GoPro. Uh, we have I got... had no idea about cameras then, but it seems like it was the idea. go-to camera. Yeah. <clears throat> but it's because uh, we do a lot of vlogging in the house uh, and inside the caravans and stuff like that. Mm-hmm. GoPros are not very brilliant at low light. So someone, yeah, I've been looking at YouTube, and uh, a lot of people said you should try. Um, is the it in- Insta 360 Ace Pro? Mm-hmm. So, uh, that's a lot better in low light, a lot more simple yeah. for vlogging rather than action. And we are obviously new still, although we've had a YouTube other channel for a long time. This is a new channel just for. Um, you know, 
holidays and things like that. It's kind of like I've said before, it's like a, a diary, a record of our trips, so we can share it with family um, as well. Yes, and uh, we thought we'd put it on YouTube. It's, Just to, it's, a, it's, it's a, an easier way of um, storing uh, our memories, and we thought um, might as well share them with you. Yeah, uh, because at some level that must be entertaining well think. it's not only that where we we trying out different caravan parks and usually before if i see anywhere because i like cheapest chips and if i see um if i see a place because we are kind of we still love great yarmouth it's mainly caster and hemsby where we tend to go these days but i still love that place but what we're doing is we're trying other places out that are not expensive and um, we put it on YouTube because I like to uh, look online and we used to go on YouTube to see if other people had put places on, didn't we? So we could just say, uh, actually, it looks like. We have got, uh, next year, we've booked, um, we're going to Skegness, Skegness but we're going to uh, Haven and we're going to Park Dean. So that'll be interesting to, we're checking out of one uh, into another, so that'll be interesting, won't it? But it is, uh, we're, we're planning on going back to the other haven at Blackpool, um, Merton something, I can't remember what it is, and we're going to compare that to the, is it Carla Gran or? Do you know, I yap a lot, I chatter too much, and I've just checked, he said, um, any videos I do, keep it brief. And I've been on 16, 16 minutes. <laughs> the amount of editing I have to do. I mean, <laughs> a couple of months ago, I, I knew zero about editing. Mm -hmm. I, would, I would say I'm not even, I'm sort of a beginner even now. I'm playing about things. There's things I'm still finding out that uh, I'm not... Uh, you're getting uh, there you're getting stuff. there because on our I'm earlier there, videos um, we couldn't figure out with the kitchen because we've got the big I don't know what you call it that big light that runs like a rectangular thing across the ceiling but we used to have that on and when we looked at the videos I was flickering and we've tried different ways I think he brought a light to put mm -hmm. on I don't know what? It's just a light brand i think it's the same brand is it you the same as this yeah your lamsey or whatever it's called and but but now he's learned how to on the editing um to do the flickering so we are getting well he's getting better not me um i am got a, a, a scooby-doo for my she, she done a little bit of editing the other day <laughs> and she picked it up quicker than i did it's easier me waffling and him editing but she's uh she's just lazy really um, she's got a lazy nature about her. So this is where he deserves a belt round the chops. <laughs> and when, can I just say, I'm always saying to Andy, I'm going to give him a belt round the chops. But I never do. It's just banter. It's very abusive. No, it's just banter. So anyway, I'm going to stop this for now because it's going on for 18 plus minutes. And... Him indoors, he's gonna to have to do some editing to cut a lot of this out because I just waffle on. And so it's goodbye from me, and I'll see you soon. And it's goodbye from me as well. Uh, see you soon, stay safe, and have a good one. <laughs>